welcome back to today's video. So we are just doing another impromptu floor <laughs> haul and I have my assistants of course. Hope you guys don't mind this setup. My beauty room is currently um, sort of under construction and it is a mess because I'm redoing it. So I was like, I'm just going to do a chill version of a PR beauty unboxing. I've been saving up these packages for a couple weeks now and I want to share with you guys what is new in makeup, what I received in the mail. A lot of times since I am more of a like a micro influencer, basically just means like a smaller <laughs> influencer, I get some things that are in PR that are maybe different from other YouTubers that you've seen, which I think is really cool and interesting. I like trying out all the brands I get to try out and I am so grateful for the PR I receive. It makes it so much easier for me to test out products. So I am very grateful and of course will always give you guys my honest thoughts on if I like a product or not. I am not swayed by if I get sent something and I always want to give you guys the truthful, honest answer on things because you work hard for your money and I want to make sure that you guys are getting a bang for your buck. I also like to be able to test the products out before I recommend things to you guys because I want to give you a full review and opinion on it to let you know if it's worth your money or not. So I hope you guys are excited for this video. If you want to find out what I get as a smaller influencer in PR and also see what all is new in makeup, then just keep watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I upload tons of content every week, hauls, shop with me's, affordable beauty, Dollar Tree, TJ Maxx. So if you like all that, then you will really like my channel. At least I hope so. So without further ado, let's get on into the haul. over here to the right of me usually when I film these videos everything is behind me on my desk the first thing I have is from Avon and but I actually really enjoy a lot of my Avon products obsessed with their vanilla and coconut line lotion amazing they smell like cotton candy those have been in favorites videos they sent over this CBD line and it's funny sometimes they'll send stuff and it's like not Avon brand it's just like stuff that they sell on their website so this is Villament Villament CBD multi bomb stick. This one is geranium and this one is jasmine. Neither of which are my like favorite scents. I'm not a big floral person to begin with, but I personally cannot stand the scent of jasmine. I think it smells like pea um, and geranium. I don't love either. So I'll probably just end up putting these in a giveaway. They did send me over also a CBD bath oil, which I have been using like right before I get out of the shower. I feel really smooth from it. I really like it. And there's no THC in these. So just to give you guys a look, maybe you like these scents and you want to check them out if you really like florals. I'm still like trying to figure out and process this whole CBD thing. Like I really see a difference. Right now I'm using a Derma E moisturizer that has CBD. I really like it a lot. Like it's super luxurious. I just don't know if the CBD like has any sort of effect for me. You guys can relate to that. I don't know. Like jury's still out on the ingredient for me basically. I know it helps a lot with people's anxiety. Um, I definitely would like to try that because I do get anxiety a lot every day. I've seen they have like different flavored ones. There's like a uh, cotton candy ones, not like from Avon, separate websites. So maybe you guys have had a good experience with that, but I do have, um, my friend always like raves about taking it by mouth and she like spurs by it. So the stuff that's like not in packages that I've already opened. So the Inkey List skincare brand that is affordable at Sephora and it's like so crazy because Sephora never had affordable lines, so the Inky List really kind of broke the mold with that. So they actually recently launched hair care, and I'm working with them on a TikTok video, which is really exciting. I'm um, kind of like in the process of making it. So I'm sure most of you guys have heard of Olaplex. It is basically a bond repair treatment if you have bleach or damage or color damage to your hair and you're trying to restore your hair it basically is like special ingredients that restore the bonds back in your hair so this is like a dupe product a more affordable version of that it's the pca bond repair hair treatment i don't think these are on sephora's website yet i think they're only on the in key list website so i will link it down below for you guys so this has an ingredient called pyrolodine carboxylic acid and it's called PCA Bond Repair Hair Treatment. I don't know if I said that already. <laughs> it says shake well and you can use it. And I have used this a couple times. Use on towel dry damp hair, ensuring you cover all your hair, excluding your scalp, 
for more damaged areas like the ends of your hair and it says four to six sprays for short hair and then six to ten sprays for longer thicker hair this is a post washing product and it's also something you can leave in instead of rinsing out which i thought was really neat um that you can just kind of spray it on and it helps to restore the damage of your hair the only thing i will say with this is that the sprayer is so difficult to spray like, it's nice that there's like a little finger imprint but i'm like oh like to spray this down is very difficult that's the downside to this product it made my hair look nice i think it is definitely a good dupe for olaplex i like the exact same thing because olaplex has patented technology that no one can duplicate and also something i want to know about this is that it does have silicones in it so if you are like scared of silicones for your hair i'm not really scared of silicones in my hair necessarily but just wanted to mention that and they also launched uh, hyaluronic acid which I really love this this makes my hair super nice and soft and I feel like it does a really good job of controlling my frizz so you usually think of hyaluronic acid so it's very interesting that they took that and they made it as a frizz treatment for your hair which I thought was really innovative so it says one to two pumps uh, massage through your hands you could use this on wet or dry hair I've not tried it on my wet hair yet I've only tried it on dry but I really like it for my ends so I did a Instagram video about these but if you guys remember from like the early 2000s all me was so famous for those eyeshadow palettes that match your eye color they recently relaunched them and I was like this is such a throwback because I remember thinking those shades in the palette were like the only shades that I could use on my brown eyes like I had to have the brown eye palette from Almay. I couldn't use the one for green eyes because that would just be unacceptable because now it's like we use any sinking color we want to. Like anything could look good on your eyes. So I just thought it was funny and they re-released them. So we have the green eyes palette which is more of like, I actually love the green eyes one. It has like a pretty purple and some gray tones. This one is for blue eyes which I do think would look really pretty on blue eyes. We have the one for brown eyes, um, and this is also really nice. If you guys want to see a tutorial, I will link it down below. And then this one is for hazel eyes, and I love this one too because there's like blues and greens. It's actually crazy. I was like, oh, this isn't going to be that good. What am I going to think of these? The formula is actually really good, you guys. I was pretty impressed by these. So check them out if you're interested. Again, I will link these products down below for you guys. But this is called All My Intense Eye, Eye Dot Color Shadow Palette. So I like them. When I use them, I was like, wow, these are actually really nice shadows. They weren't like chalky or anything like that. Like if you want to, I mean, some people might still just want a palette that they see at the drugstore that's for their eye color. And maybe that will help them. But I mean, I would use every single shade in all these palettes. Next up, I got a bunch of polishes from Pacifica, which you guys know I love Pacifica. And their products are so good. So we have a couple different like types of nail polishes. This is so cool. It's called Plant Magic and it's 16 free. Like what? <laughs> I didn't even know that was a thing because... Back in the day, it used to just be three free. Now we're up to 16. So I'm like, what about all those polishes? What was I using? But now they had to get rid of 13 other things. So these shades are super cute. We have a yellow. This is like a kind of holographic. Not like full on holographic, but it's a little bit. Um, not like super strong with the Color Club ones. And then this one is a silver holographic i'm so excited to try these i think maybe i will do this tonight and then this is their bio glitter it's a transparent top coat how fun are these and these are all at ulta again i will link these below for you guys and this is another one of the bio glitters this is more like a silver this is more like a gold glitter they're just like plain shades from their line i love this like lavender color and then we have a gray i'm really excited to try these out especially um pairing like the solid colors with the glitter yeah thank you so much to pacifica for sending those over i think i also have another pacifica package to open down here so we'll see what's inside i have next up some stuff from derma e more hair stuff and this stuff is really cool so this is a scalp relief treatment with tea tree oil aloe vera herbal blend so if you guys don't know derma e is, is a natural brand 
So they use more like essential oils, put parabens, phthalates, formaldehyde, petrolatum, sulfates, no mineral oils, no artificial fragrances or colors. They are 100% vegan, cruelty free, gluten free, soy free, recyclable. So many good things going here. This one I have not tried yet. It's like in a little dropper. Let's actually just open this up. Oh wow, this is interesting. It's like a very blue, milky kind of formula here. So that's cool. It says it has aloe vera, sea kelp, and adaptogens um, combined with an herbal blend to promote a balanced and hydrated scalp for optimal health. I definitely want a balanced scalp. I am currently just trying everything I can to make my hair super healthy again. So I love trying out different like healthy hair products. And then this is their keratin thickening spray. I've tried this has biotin, mint, and the chanterelle mushroom to condition, nourish, strength, add volume for styling. I think this might be better for wet hair. I tried it before for on my dry hair, like literally uh, an hour ago, and I felt like it was just too wet <laughs> to use on my dry hair. Like I started to see like little waves forming. It says added boost of volume formulated with keratin and biotin. Our vitamin and protein enriched spray gives hair instant lift of volume and height. So usually with something like that, the scalp will rosemary extract and mint oils, hair follicles to promote healthy hair with a natural touchable feel. We'll continue trying this. Maybe it's something I can use while my hair is still wet. And then this next item is the Derma E Bonding Hair Repair Oil, which looks suspiciously like my Olaplex hair oil, even the bottle. So I was like, hmm, wait a second. So this has chaga mushroom. I love they're including more of the like adaptogen mushrooms in their formulas. Jojoba and amla oil. So it says it's a weightless bonding oil to strengthen and boost shine formulated with nourishing oils to moisturize, tame, and protect hair. Adaptogen chaga mushroom renews hair of vibrancy while jojoba oil helps to repair damaged hair for healthy looking style. So I used this before because I wanted to see how it was and I really, really liked it. I felt like it moisturize my hair and and made it smooth without weighing it down like some oils can do and it literally looks identical to my olaplex oil which i thought was so cool thank you so much to derma e for sending those over i will link all these below on the ulta website next up this is something i already opened it is actually from carity and they sent over a bunch of their lip glosses i have their matte liquid lipsticks that i really like so we have tons of shades here and uh, let's see, they sent over six shades. And these are pretty. I wore one the other day. I think this was the one I wore, which is called Zahava. And this is just like a pretty pink shimmery gloss. This one is Molly. This is like another pretty rosy neutral color. So thank you so much to Carity for sending these over. If you guys want to see me using these, I'm going to be making a little TikTok video. So follow me on TikTok, you guys. I post so much stuff on there, like a lot of stuff that doesn't even make it to my YouTube channel. This next package is from Maskology, so let's open it up. Have some fun masks here, and I believe this brand is sold at Walmart, which you guys know I am like Walmart's biggest fan. I always post Walmart videos, so this is really fun. I think I've actually tried this one, the Watermelon Moisturizing Mask. This is a dupe for the Glow Recipe Watermelon line. Also have their Charcoal Modeling Peel Off Mask and it says purifying, pour control, calming, and it even comes with like a little spatula. And we have their Hyaluronic Gummy Modeling Mask. That sounds really interesting. And it looks like it even comes with like a little mixing tray. Mix it yourself modeling mask goes on like a jelly and peels off like a gummy for hydrated and firmer skin. Oh, that is cool. Oh, but darn, this has niacinamide in it, which, gah, everything, everything is niacinamide now. Let me check this one. I, I'm like a broken record with the freaking niacinamide, you guys. I am so sorry. These look so cool. I am very excited to try these out. I love testing out new masks. This next package, I don't know where it's from. It might be a PR company, so let's open it and see. Oh, it is from Revlon. I love getting Revlon stuff. And this says, everyone needs a good foundation, and it comes in this really cool, like, little bullet purse. I always send really cute reusable bags in their PR mailing, which I appreciate. Oh, this is so fun. It is their Revlon 
Colorstay Light Cover Foundation. I actually saw this at the drugstore and I wanted to try this. So it says natural finish, 12 hour wear. And they sent over three shades. This one's definitely gonna be too light, 110 Ivory. We have 150 Buff, which is usually my shade, and 210 Creme Brulee, which is probably the one I will use. So if you guys wanna see a video on this foundation, I can definitely do one. And this also has SPF in it, which is pretty cool. So we will see how that is. Their buffing foundation brush. That's really neat. So I can use that when I'm doing the review. So you can like wear this like a little bag. It comes with a strap. That's really fun. Next up, we have a package here from Miss Swiss. This is a makeup brush holder and it actually has my name on it. How adorable is this? This would be super cute if I had like a little shelf um, to put this on because you can like display it. This is so cute. So like you can put your brushes in here and they just kind of stand up in there. So stinking cute. Thank you so much to Miss Swiss for sending this over and actually like personalizing it. That is so sweet. All right, guys, next up we have a package here from one of my favorite skincare brands, Dr. Zenovia. I've already used up two of the products that they've sent to me. That's saying a lot to use up a skincare product. So let's see what they send over. I always get so excited to try their stuff out because I really like their ingredients. So we have two products here. Oh, I actually already have this one and I'm currently using it. The Peptide and Ceramide Repairing Moisturizer. So I'll just keep this in my like, I guess, skincare backup draw. And then this is their Hyaluronic Acid and Peptide Serum. This is so cool. Gluten-free, artificial color-free, no mineral oil, uh, Bacchiol, Reservatrol, white tea, green tea extract, cucumber fruit, aloe, zinc. So good. So it's clinical grade hyaluronic acid to provide nourishing hydration. I've been wanting to incorporate more peptide products in my skincare routine, especially because, you know, age and everything, it's really important to start keeping your skin, your skin plump. So this is awesome. Thank you so much to Dr. Zenovia. You can get their brand at Sephora. Again, I will link their brand down below if you guys want to check them out. But I really, really love their products so far. And I do think they are super nice and gentle. And they're also for um, if you have like hormonal acne, they're like specifically targeted for that skin type. Next up, we have a drugstore skincare package. This is from Yes2. So let's open this up. So this is their new Yes2 avocado line. I love avocados. You guys know. So this is a fragrance-free line, which is really exciting. I know... A lot of people have been trying to avoid fragrance because it's supposed to not be the best for your skin and I feel like it's definitely hard to find things that are fragrance free because I think a lot of brands add fragrance because a product on its own doesn't always smell that great like it always smells a little off but this should be interesting it says 90% natural ingredients so we have their fragrance free daily cream cleanser this is the oh it's a hand cream a fragrance free daily hand cream with hyaluronic acid I definitely needed a hand cream for my bag, so that is great. We have the Yes2 Fragrance Free Daily Mineral Lotion with SPF 15 and Hyaluronic Acid. I did see these at Target as well if you guys like were looking for them. And then this is the Yes2 Fragrance Free Daily Eye Cream. And then lastly, we have the Yes2 Avocado Fragrance Free Hydrating Cream Mask. And it is so hard to find cream masks without fragrance too. It also said on the little card they sent that they have like a new look on their packaging and it's supposed to be more modern. I'm so glad that the drugstore has more options now for things that are fragrance free. This is really great. Um, I'm gonna test these out and let you guys know my thoughts in a future video. Next up, we have a package from Bliss. Ooh, this is so cool. So this says it's exclusive at Target and they sent over a ton of their products here we have the block star spf 30 sunscreen we have the spa to go oh these are minis how cute i love mini skincare moisture intensifier hyaluronic acid facial we have a detoxifying 10 minute charcoal mask drench and quench rich water cream for all day moisture or refining 10 minute volcanic sand facial we have the resurfacing 10 minute enzyme facial and then this is also the drench and quench cream to water hydrator with hyaluronic acid i feel like that's like the ingredient 
of the year. Bliss, I love their products and I can't wait to test some of these out. Next up, we have another package from Pacifica, which I am so excited about. Let's see what is in here. They always send like such fun stuff. <gasps> is this fragrance? Oh my goodness, I think it's fragrance and I'm so excited. I love their scents. Oh my goodness, we have two new scents. So I love their scents because they're more clean than traditional fragrances. So this is Flower Moon. <laughs> I'm laughing because the top note is Jasmine and I literally said uh, earlier, I literally said earlier that I do not like Jasmine. So we'll have to see how this combo is because there's actually two scents here I do like, Peach and Vanilla. And I was literally thinking today how much I wanted a peach scented fragrance. And then this is Dream Moon with patchouli, sandalwood, and pink rose. And these are like different moods. This perfume is formulated with corn grain alcohol and without phthalates, parabens, polyacrylic musks, nitro musks, and our extensive no list. Which is really good. It's made in the USA with global ingredients. So just like another look so you guys can see. And these are also available at Ulta. Oh, and the packaging says you are so pretty thank you pacifica that is so cute it's like ombre i love that oh this bottle is so cute it looks like cotton candy i'm gonna spray it on here these are 22 dollars and they're also available at target i mentioned ulta so ulta target and pacifica's website these are inspired by phases of the moon oh wait i love this one. Oh my gosh this smells so good this this one reminds me of, oh, I love this one. Okay, this one definitely is so yummy. It's like a unisex scent. It gives me Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande cloud vibes. Oh, I love it because it has that little bit of masculine to it and the rose is not like rose. Mm. Oh my gosh, this smells absolutely amazing. Okay, so I'm so excited about this one. Thank you so much Pacifica for sending these over. We'll link these down below for you guys. You must check this one out, Dream a Moon. Oh, it smells so good. You guys, if you like unisex scents, check it out. Or like Ariana Grande or Clonde Cloud, you will really like this one. All right guys, last package. It's getting darker outside, so I just pointed my ring light on me. A huge package here from Kerasauce, which is more of a higher-end hair care brand. So let's open this up and see what's inside. There is a lot of stuff in here, and I can never read their packaging because it's like all in French. But this is their Chronologiste line, and it's a fragrance in oil leave-in. Uh, this exceptional combination of noble notes from the world of fine fragrance, tea rose, light woods, and musk. Oh, I think it's a hair fragrance oil. That's pretty cool. Um, apply one to two pumps on dry hair, leave-in. So, okay, it's a perfume hair oil, which I don't think I own one of these, so that's really cool. We this smells. Actually, let's open it up. We're on a fragrance kick right now. Ooh, it is a little pump bottle. I, for some reason, didn't know. I thought it was going to be like a spray, but... Interesting. It kind of just smells like rose to me. Is rose a note? Yeah, tea rose. I just don't love rose. So this is not going to be my jam, but I like the concept of having like a fragrance hair oil. This is the K Nutritive 8 Hour Magic Night Serum, Overnight Nourishing Serum for Dry Hair. I think I heard this was really good. So let's try that out. This is like some bougie hair stuff right here. This is the Chronologist uh, Essential Revitalizing Blow Dry Care for Length and Ends. This is a leave-in. This is the Chronologist Pre-Cleanse Charcoal Purifying Pre-Shampoo pre for Hair and Scalp. This is the Densifique Hyaluronic Acid Peptide Botifying Shampoo. That's cool. Chronologist shampoo, revitalizing shampoo for hair and scalp. It says has abacin and hyaluronic acid, removes impurities from scalp, reveals stronger nourished hair. This is really nice. And then we have this Chronologist mask. It says it's infused with abacin, hyaluronic acid, instant transformation with durable moisture, softness and shine. After shampooing, apply from roots and then leave on after, rinse off after five minutes. You can just like put this in your shower. So this is the hair mask. Wow, this is so cool. I feel like 
so fancy right now with these hair products. I have to test these out and let you guys know what my thoughts are on them. Um, the thing with me is that I really don't like shampoo my hair too much. I do it literally like once a week and then the other days I put a shower cap on and I just wash off my body because I try not to wash my hair too much. I try to let it go for as long as possible. But this is so cool. I'm really excited to try out this new line from Kerastase. So fancy. Thank you guys for this PR beauty unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I got in PR. This was so much fun. And now the next best part besides an opening is actually testing everything out and seeing how everything is and how I love it and or maybe don't love it. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Give a big thumbs up if you like PR unboxings because when you guys thumbs up my videos, it helps me out so much, especially with the YouTube algorithm. So my videos get seen by more people. So thank you guys for your support. I love you so much and I will see you in my next one. Bye.